Friends, this is Simarjit Singh, and I found the English translation of these very inspiring verses from the Srimad Bhagavad Gita on a, in a forwarded WhatsApp message. And these words, they gave me a lot of strength and courage um, during a very difficult time. And I hope they do the same for you. Powerful reminder here, do not get too attached with your worldly possessions. Do not burden yourself with the worry of things which you cannot control. And do not identify too much with the world the way as we see it. I'm sure these verses will heighten your perception and will help you look at your worries and your challenges in a different way. Why do you worry without cause? Why do you worry without cause? Whom do you fear without reason? Who can kill you? The soul is neither born nor does it die. Whatever happened, happened for the good. Whatever is happening is also happening for the good. And whatever will happen will also happen for the good. You need not have any regrets for the past. You need not worry for the future. The present is happening. The present is happening. What did you lose that you cry about? What did you bring with you which you think you have lost? What did you produce which you think got destroyed? <laughs> you did not bring anything. Whatever you have, you received from here. Whatever you have given, you have given it back only here. Whatever you took, you took it from God. And whatever you gave, you gave it to Him. You came empty-handed. And you will leave empty-handed. What is yours today belonged to someone else yesterday and will belong to someone else the day after tomorrow. You are mistakenly enjoying the thought that this thing is yours. And it is this false happiness that is the cause of all your sorrows. Change is the eternal law of the universe. What you think of as death is indeed life. In one instance, you can be a millionaire. And in the other instance, you can be steeped in poverty. Yours and mine, big and small, erase these distinctions from your mind. Then everything is yours. Then everything is yours and you belong to everyone. This body, this body is not yours. Neither are you of the body. This body is not yours, neither are you of the body. The body is made up of fire, water, air, earth and ether and will disappear back into these elements. But your soul is permanent. But the soul is permanent, so who are you? Who are you then? Dedicate your being to God. Dedicate your existence to God. He is the one to be ultimately relied upon. Those who know of His support are forever free from fear, worry and sorrow. Dedicate your existence to God. He is the one to be ultimately relied upon. And those who know of His support are forever free from fear, worry and sorrow. Whatever you do, do it as a dedication to the Almighty. Whatever you do, do it as a dedication to God. This will bring you the tremendous experience of joy, inner peace and freedom. Thank you for listening. Namaste.